Hey guys, or welcome back to Spooky Island and we're back in another reaction. So today I'm here reacting to G Idol's second full album, The Audio Snippet. So this is basically um what I believe to be like a a remix or preview basically of their album. They have done it. A few a few different groups uh, decided to do it ahead of their album. Some soloists do it as well. JK did it. GU did it from from twice as well. So I really like uh, reacting to these. You guys really enjoy them. If you guys are a fan of G Idol, you want to check out more reactions from there. You can check them out in the G Idol playlist on the channel. I'm excited to get into this. I think um, this comeback for them is going to be very big. They have had a lot of good releases last year. Queen Card was one of the highest rated and one of a lot of people's favourite songs from uh, K-pop last year. So that was a, a very, very big thing. Um, and in my opinion, I think they have been doing very, very well since they debuted all those years ago. Uh, the fact that they were a part of KDA. KDA is, is, is still to date. Uh, one of my favorite projects i've seen in the music industry obviously the way they they collabed with a gaming company and and a music producers to make this kind of like k-pop game uh you know sound it was really really cool uh, i still listen to a lot of their songs now anyway um i'm very excited we are gonna get into this uh this is three minutes 20 so i imagine we're gonna get an audio snippet of a few different um a few different songs on this album, maybe every single one. I'm excited. Without further ado, we're going to get straight into it. Let's get into it. Let's do it. We've got our second full album. I like the, the name of the album. is good as well. I'm excited. Ooh. Oh, this is sick. It's like a PC. Okay, we've got a media player. Ooh, okay. So there's teaser, story film, music video teaser, poster, online release, offline release. Oh, there's seven tracks. The title is Spicy Lady. Oh, it doesn't let you play it. That's good. <laughs> oh. I like how it doesn't play the title cap. That's quite funny. Oh. Oh, they cut out the drop. Okay, that's a very good song. Oh, I like this as well. I like how they've did they've, they've done this. is very entertaining, very cool. Oh, I like this. This is a bit of a longer sip it as well. Very cool. Very cool. This is very cool. Okay, next one. I like this. Okay, this is also very good. There's a there's a big mix of different songs in here. Okay, we've got three left, right? We've got three left. Okay, is this more of an instrumental or a vocal-led song? Oh, there we go. I like this as well. Oh, they cut the chorus, man. Okay, uh, this is good. This is very good. I love the guitar already. Oh, this is sick. Okay, last one. There's a lot of different sounds here. This is this is very good. Roly, this could be a this could be a fan favorite. That was very, very good. But it's so funny how they they tried to click on the the um they tried to click on the the title and it would come up. 
It's very funny. My favourites out of here when if I was going off of first impressions, second song, very, very good. Um I think that drop is gonna be very, very big. It could be really, really entertaining. I like a lot of the song. I pre I think every song has their own kind of um their own kind of feel to it. None of the songs really sound the same. They've other they've all got uh kind of a completely like a totally different kind of vibe to it. The second one seems to have a very big drop. Probably very cool choreography might be the lead B side. Um and then Roly at the end was really cool. I love the guitar. Um and it seems like with the the last song as well, it seems like it could be it could be like a um I don't know, there, there seems to have it the last song could definitely be um a fan favourite because the thing with G Idol is that they are a group that um make songs that you wouldn't expect a K pop group to make, if you know what I mean. Some of their sounds sometimes they are you know, they have a Western sound. Sometimes they uh they mix up completely and obviously with I want that and, and songs that are uh similar that were on their UK EP that come out. Um, they were very, very good songs. They were very, very good songs. Some of the songs like sounded like songs that would be produced here in the UK. So that's a very big compliment because to be able to produce a song of, not just of that quality that they have, but to produce a song that is um, like, if somebody who wasn't a fan of K-pop and to, work, to listen to it, they would probably enjoy it anyway, which is why I think it's really entertaining that they have kind of gone the complete uh the the complete i guess not in a bad way but the, a complete different way that i guess I I, a lot of people didn't know what this comeback would be and it seems to be probably the best possible case scenario for them they they have a title track that nobody knows about we're obviously going to get the music video teaser closer to the time in the next few weeks uh i'll be reacting to more of the stuff when it does come out but right now it's looking very good. It's looking very good, I must admit. I'm very excited um to see more. I I'm I'm very excited. I think G Idol are like I said, I think they're a group that a lot of people are fans of, a lot of people have been fans of for a while. Um so to see them kind of have a sound that I, I would say is quite unique because they have a lot of different songs there that are quite different from each other, which on a on an album on a very good album is what you want you know you want to have different sounds you don't want to have five or six same songs that sound similar there's a there's a there's a distinctive difference between the songs and that, that is very good i'm very excited and anyway, i hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys soon if you want to check out more g idol we actually check them out on the channel and i'll see you guys soon take care